Hi guys, my name is Gina Gemsco and welcome to a tour of some new architect homes we have in Sims Freeplay. These came out at the beginning of November 2017. We have nine new houses. Here is the first one and this can be built on a premium lot. This looks like a remodel of one of the houses that we have in the game already, possibly. As usual with these, we're looking for rare items or items worth a lot of LP or SP. We've got a fish tank. Let me know in the comments. You guys are always so good at commenting down below on things that I'm like, mm, is it this? Is it that? You guys always know. Volleyball net. That's a limited time prize from one of the event, one of the quests. We've got a basement here, so let's go down into the ooh into the basement. This is a nice basement. We've got some kids toys. Which, the kids toys tend to be like a lot of LP, I feel, for the kids toys. Like, I think these bricks are 12 LP, something like that. So if you've not got many kids toys, this potentially could be worth building. What else do we have? Ooh, we have some of the fairy stuff. You may want to build it for this fairy stuff. It's so adorable. And yeah, that's it. Let's go upstairs. I think we had a second floor, didn't we? Second floor... Ooh, we have a nice outdoor area. Another fish tank, some more spa bathroom stuff. Here's the second house. Again, it needs to be built on a premium lot. And some spa stuff. Again, these romantic swings. I love those. We've got one of these record players that I believe is SP or LP, one of the two anyway. Uh, let's have a little look outside. We've got another volleyball net. Have we got? We've gone upstairs, so let's check out the upstairs. Ooh, very pink upstairs. Nice, we've got that unicorn painting. That was a limited time prize from a quest. If you didn't win that, you may want to get it. Nothing massively rare, but a reasonably nice build. Here's the third house. Again, another premium size lot. We've got a wedding arbor straight away. I think that's 12 LP to buy a wedding arbor. They're quite nice, I quite like those. And how many times have I said nice? I feel like that's the only adjective that I've used so far in this video. Maybe I need to try and find some different adjectives to use. Uh, we've got these staircases, which are awesome. I'll use awesome instead of nice. That these, I don't know whether the white ones or the uh, the wood ones, one of them is only available with the French Chateau, I think. I'm not sure. Somebody will comment down below and let me know the information on that. But they are definitely kind of a rare item. We've got the gaming computer, two screen computer there, which I love. As you know, if you watch these videos, I'm always saying how much I love those. And yeah, that's kind of it for this floor. Let's go down. We've got a basement. Oh, kind of a little cinema basement. Awesome. Now, my new word now is awesome. <laughs> Let's go up to the next floor. We've got a big fish tank there, which is available for real money or was available for real money. I don't know if it's still available. The black piano, what's the deal with the black piano? Somebody let us know down in the comments. I know that I have the black piano. Was that kind of available as a prize from something? Or it's like, I'm sure it's not just standard that you get within the game. Let us know down about that down below. Fourth house is a standard size lot. Straight away, I can see that Scandinavian TV, which I absolutely love. I have never, I've never I don't know where I've got any, but it's available for SP. And I don't think I've ever, ever used it. Because it's, I feel like it's a really lot of SP and I can't afford it. Although you have kind of noticed that I have got quite a lot of SP at the moment. I've got a video coming tomorrow about how I got all of that SP. So make sure you're subscribed to the channel so you can uh, see that video. And click the bell as well so you make sure you get a notification of when I upload. An onion, gold onion bookcase there. What else do we have? That rug, I feel is SP. We have a volleyball net as well. And then we've got a basement, so let's check out the basement. I like the feel of this house, I like the colour schemes. We've got a Scandinavian bed, I really do like the Scandinavian furniture. It is one of my favourite, uh, like, themes for the furniture. It's a nice little basement. Let's go up and look at the first floor. How many have we got? Yeah, we've just got one more floor. Cute bedroom. I really do like this house, I like the gaming computer. I like the colour scheme. This wallpaper is nice. Let's see it as a whole, what it looks like. It's just... I like it. I don't know what it is about it that I really like, but I just kind of like it. Here's the fifth house. This is on a premium sized lot. We got. Let's check out the basement first. Why not? Let's do it slightly differently. We've got a fish tank here. Some spa furniture. 
Let's go up to the first floor. This is really hard guys, right? I, over the weekend, I broke my wrist. If you don't watch my vlogging channel, which you should, by the way, I daily vlog every single day. Uh, yeah, I, I broke my wrist at the weekend and so everything is kind of having to be done one-handed and it's really bad. <laughs> I've never like broken or done anything in my whole life. It's like the first time ever and oh, nightmare. But anyway, back to the Sims free play. What have we got? Anything? I like the kind of whole white theme of this house. I maybe like might have a go at doing that, like coloured themed houses. Because sometimes I struggle for what I'm gonna build next and what I want to try building. And maybe coloured themes, like an all red house and all black house, or like a black and white house. Or I think that would be cool. Let me know if you um if you like the idea of that. Okay, there's nothing really rare or anything in this house. But I do like this build. These are some nice houses actually. Look. I really like that. I'm impressed with these houses. Here's the sixth house. This is a little cute house. It can be built on a standard sized lot. We've got some of these party balloons, which I love, the, especially that colour. I really like it. And we've got two either side of this uh, front door. For a designer kitchen with a little pool in the centre. You kind of like, you, to get out that door, you have to get out, you have to get into the pool. It's like, <laughs> you didn't want to go in the pool? Tough. You've got to go in. And oh, we've got a little fire monkey statue, which is LP or SP, one of the two. And I really should learn what is for LP and what is for SP, shouldn't I? Because I never know. When I do these videos, I'm like, it's LP or SP, not sure which. Disco ball, again, is LP or SP. And these party lights are from the party event, if you didn't do that. And then let's go have a little look upstairs. Some spa furniture. Spa furniture seems to be very, very popular these bedrooms they're just I've never thought of like using that table like that but I quite like that setup like to me it's looks like an outdoor table and you just put it outside but I like that it's a bit different I love it when you see like different like quirky different ideas of how people have decorated and it's kind of got two teenage bedrooms here kind of Here's the seventh house, a very outdoorsy type of feel to this house. The front yard, or kind of just, I don't know, it's just all outdoors really, isn't it? It can be built on a standard size lot. We have these trees that are SP to buy, and we're a nice hot tub out there. This is a nice little area. Oh, these corner fountains. I really do like these corner fountains. They're one of my favourite little decoration items, but they are five LP or SP, I believe. We've got a tiny little indoor little lounge area here. And then, should we go downstairs? We've got a basement. Oh, and then it's all downstairs in the basement. Kind of everything is down here. Yeah, we've got a spa, bathroom, bedroom. We've got it all. Oh, one of these, you know those are my favourite fireplaces. I absolutely adore those fireplaces. Then what have we got? Have we got a floor? Oh, oh no, we haven't. I really like that, that it just looks, I may try building a house like this actually where it's just kind of all outdoor, nice outdoor area, you've just got a little bit of, uh, a little bit of inside like that you can actually see and then it's all down below, I've never tried building a house like that. House number eight and a standard size lot house and we've got, a oh we've got a couple of floors, wow look at this, quite a few floors, very colourful it looks. Are they escalators? I feel like they're escalators. Are they? I think so. I've never noticed that they have like a plumb bob on the sides of them. That's cool. What have we got? Nothing. Nothing rare, particularly. Go and have a little look upstairs. Ooh, very confusing this house. It's like stuff everywhere. It's like really decorated. Which I love. I love a house when they've been, like, it's been really, like, oh, look, like a little massage kind of area there. Oh, we've got a little sauna. That's cool. Loads of little, like, different entranceways and things, I feel. Wow, so much stuff. So much stuff. Look, like, every little, like, nook and cranny has been used. I really like it. That's cool. I mean, there's nothing particularly rare. Again, nothing particularly rare. I'm loving these houses. And then here is our last house, standard sized lot. Straight away, I can see this camera, which I absolutely love. 
I love that camera. I may have to build this house just for that. It's, some, it's gonna cost me like 30 million or something ridiculous to build this house just for the camera. Oh, yes, we've got a transporter thing. So I, you can't get them in the game anymore and I love them. Like partly I love them for like space saving. They only take up like, two, well, two blocks. Does anybody have them like they're available to them to buy? Let me know down in the comments or is it just they're available for a short period of time and then like whatever you've got now is whatever you've got you can't get anymore you know, like at christmas or whatever when they release the christmas stuff and then they stay in your infantry but you can't get them throughout the year let me know what the deal is with these if you didn't do the laundry live laundry event and get these you may want to build this house for them we've got a rocket that's cool we've got a nice little laundry room here there whoa look at all this kid stuff this house is awesome we haven't got all of this kid stuff potentially there's so much we've got a pirate bed we've got one of those cute oh wow we've got so so much going on if you haven't unlocked these prize things yet wow i really like this oh if you didn't do the teen event where we got the is it teen life where we got the te um the teen beds and stuff the bunk beds so much going on i really like this okay let's go up did we look around this floor? Yeah, we kind of, there was nothing massive on this floor, was there? To the next floor, and oh, we got some of these bar stools and the tables, and some Latin stuff, Latin bar and Latin table there. Spa stuff. Oh, look at this little meditation area. Oh, I love this build. Oh, got another floor. I wasn't expecting that. Sauna area, gym area with another games machine. Oh, look, you can camp on the roof. That's so cool. <laughs> I love that. Oh, there's a bed. Oh, this is awesome. And it, oh, look, I was just spotted a fondue set. You know how I love a good fondue set in my builds. So there you go, guys. That is a little tour of all nine houses. Let me know down below if any of them are your builds. I think in the last one, somebody said that one of them was their build, which was so cool. That's awesome. Let me know also in the comments if you are going to be building any of them. I'd love to know which ones you liked. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Also, if you're not subscribed to the vlogging channel, that is, there's a link down below in the description. Go ahead and subscribe to the vlogging channel. And I will see you guys tomorrow for that SP video. But thanks for watching. Bye!